So this is how you factor this trinomial with the tic-tac-toe method. Have a look. First, we draw the tic-tac-toe boxes like so. And then we are going to figure out this and that first. To do so, we ask ourselves, what times 12 give us 4x squared? And here we have two possibilities. Maybe we can have 4x times x, that's 4x squared, but we can also have 2x times 2x. So which one do we put? Well, just kind of put down something and then go to the other ones first, right? So I'm just going to put down 2x times 2x, right? And then I will come here and then I will ask myself what times what will give us negative 3? 1 times negative 3 or negative 1 times 3. Again, which one do we use? Have a look. Let's try if we have 1 times negative 3. Put that down and then here is the check. I'm going to multiply the 2x with this negative 3, this diagonal like this. 2 times negative 3 is negative 6, x. And then here, 1 times 2x gives us 2x. Well, now we are going to combine this and that. Negative 6x plus 2x, that is negative 4x. This does not give us positive 4x, so this is incorrect. But we're almost there. Imagine if we change the minus to here instead, right? 2x times 3, that's positive 6x. Negative 1 times 2x is negative 2x. 6x minus 2x, we do end up with that. So that's it. And this is how you read the answer from here. You go across when you put on the answer. So we have 2x minus 1 times the other factor is 2x plus 3. Huh? Just like this. Huh? Just like that. Yeah. If you get it wrong, just kind of fix it. Sometimes maybe you have to fix this and that. So seriously, just give it a try. If a quadratic expression right, is factorable, then you can always use the tic-tac-toe method to do it. So here is a question for you guys to try. And if you need help, I have another video for this right here. So go ahead and try this, right? Let's go ahead and factor 4x squared minus 5x minus 6. And try use the tic-tac-toe method. Leave the answer down below and let me know what you guys get. That's it.